Hello and welcome to 104 10th Street, Miamisburg, Ohio. My name is John Murray with the John Murray Group of Better Homes and Gardens Real Estate and I'll be your host. Here I'm standing in front of this home and this is adorably updated, great home, big covered porch here with a huge concrete front porch. We'll check that out here in a minute. Updated 3D dimensional shingle roof on here and a huge garage, big deck, and this is an oversized two car garage, guys easily can get two cars in that. We have street parking over here. This is Maple. And then this is 10th over here. So we have a two car driveway with the two car garage and ample street parking. And here's our huge covered front porch I was telling you about. We'll actually walk up here and take a look. And a gorgeous front door. We do have a screen door in here as well. We'll take a look at it on the inside to get some better lighting once we get in there. Getting a glare from the screen door. Ceiling fan on the front porch, and this is all hand railed off. And a great view of a fantastic neighborhood here in Miamisburg. Next, let's go inside and take a look. All right, so here I just walked through the front door, and this is a solid wood door with some frosted and etched glass on here. Lights wreaking a little havoc on here, but this is a gorgeous front door. Try to get you a better view. Over there's what it looks like in person. Get rid of the shadow there. So great front door. Picture shelf, bookshelf, whatever, built into the right here. Updated windows in this home. A lot of updates in here. Gorgeous floors flow throughout most of the first floor as well. We have a gas fireplace here, and this is a functioning gas fireplace with another built-in bookshelf on the right side here. TV does not stay, but the wall mount does. All of the window treatments do stay, and all of these windows are updated, and these blinds and curtains are all brand new in here. Perfect space for a sectional. And look at this. Boom! Opens right up into a massive dining room here. We have updated oversized baseboard here. Crown molding runs through the dining room, as does it in the living room here. So we have crown molding all over here. This double window overlooks the front porch. Just a great space, a wonderful feeling when you walk through the front door here and talk about a dining room built for entertaining. This is it right here. I could see Thanksgiving and all the holidays being held at your house. Now, when we walk through the front door, that was the staircase right over here. We'll check the second floor out here momentarily. We can go two different directions from the dining room. We can go straight into our remodeled bathroom or we can go down to the basement, which is down this way. Perfect spot for a little shelf for the keys, big mirror here, and then a full bathroom on the first floor, which is hard to find on homes of this age here. Slate tile on the walls. This is a gorgeous bathroom, guys. You have to see this in person. Slate on the flooring. Toilet that could flush a bowling ball and awesome pedestal sink here. Very, very retro while very modern at the same time. Tempered glass on the updated window here, which means you can't see through the lower pane. And then check out this kitchen. Boom! This kitchen is phenomenal. Ceramic tile on the floor. We do have a breakfast eat-in kitchen area here. An eat-at bar with a top. Now these look like the cheap Formica cutting board countertops. These are real cutting board countertops in here. GE side-by-side -side stainless steel fridge does stay. And these cabinets wrap all the way around. We even have glass and lighting inside of the kitchen. Lights wreaking a little havoc. Get you. There we go. Look at that. Lights in the cabinet. Guys, this is an awesome kitchen. Glass backsplash. Oh, you might be calling me now. GE microwave and the range stays as well. Kitchen sink looks over the back deck. And we even have under cabinet light above the sink here. Just a gorgeous, gorgeous kitchen. Guys, this is one of the nicest kitchens I have seen in this neighborhood. Pendulant lights hanging down. We even have a light above the breakfast room here. And we do have a first floor bedroom here. 
check this out. This is a huge bedroom. Hardwood floors in here, double closet, currently being used as an office. And we have crown molding in here as well. This is on the back left of the home. If you're looking at it from the street and this window will overlook the back deck. And look at this. I absolutely love these as do my wife, the sliding barn door. So you have your track right there and that is gorgeous. Home has tons of character and charm. Next, let's go check out the basement. All right, so I just walked down the stairs. They're to my right right here. And we come down to an unfinished storage area. Could easily be finished. Have some shelves right here. High efficiency Goodman furnace here. And we do have an updated air conditioner as well. Glass block windows in the basement with the vent things in here. Built into the window, I should say. This opens up into our laundry room. Updated water heater, and that furnace is just a couple years old as well, as is the water heater in the air conditioner. This is our laundry area. Check this out. This little red and blue spider thingy right here. This is a Manapex mana block system. What's cool about this, it's like a breaker box for your water system. So let's say you're, I don't know if you can see this or not. Focus, focus. Well, what that says is master bathroom tub. So we can just turn off the hot water to the master bathroom tub and not have to shut off the water to the whole house. So if you're repairing a thing, there's this little key check right here. You just turn off the problem, you know, whatever thing you're having a problem with without shutting off the water to the whole house. That is a very nice update. We even have a General Electric updated panel box here too. So mechanically, this home is set. Then check this out. Boom, finished Ohio State room. This is awesome. I can definitely see a pool table in here or a theater room. Updated glass block windows in here. We have crown molding, oversized baseboards, and it is all ready for your Buckeyes party room here. You even have these pendulum lights. Could, it's made for a pool table right there. All ceramic tile on the floors. And check this out, guys. This is a walkout basement that actually walks out right there. So you have a card party, have the friends over. You can have your own private entrance without having everybody track through the house. So gorgeous, gorgeous basement here with a ton of possibilities. The wall mount for the TV even stays. We even have a little bar top here, all kinds of possibilities. And in case your brain works like what I do, washer and dryer is right over there. And I believe the drain for it is right over there. So wet bar could go right there. All right, let's go check out the second floor. All right, so here I just walked to the top of the stairs. We have our second full bathroom here. Ceramic tile in here as well, and a large pedestal sink. Built-in medicine cabinet. We have crown molding in here as well. Updated window with the tempered glass that you can't see through the bottom pane here. Subway tile in the shower. We do have a mosaic pattern with some glass tile there. This is a high efficiency toilet up here. The toilet shelf does not stay, but perfect spot for one right there. And then check this out. Built-ins galore. Huge built-in linen cabinet here. And directly above it, we actually have a whole house fan. And this thing, I'm actually going to turn it on. So this fan's open. And guys, this was on when I got here. And this cools the house off quickly. It's very, very nice. Original hardwood floors give it all that character. And then check it out, we have another built-in cabinet here as well. Attic access over here. Now we have three bedrooms up here. This bedroom, if we're looking at it from the front, this is on the back left of the room, uh, home, excuse me. Updated ceiling fan in here. This window that we're looking at right there overlooks the backyard. This window looks the side here. We have the closet over here and great hardwood floors. A lot of character in here and a lot of space in here too. We even have a little medicine or a makeup area right there, which is very nice. Bedroom number two, this is on the front left of the home. That window is overlooking the side yard. Updated ceiling fan in here. That window is overlooking the front of the house. Crown molding through here. And the light's playing a little hectic. There we go. This is what it looks like in person. It's just such a nice bright day that it's affecting the camera. Wall mount for the TV does stay, but the TV does not. Solid wood 
original door right here to the closet. Very, very nice. And we have a third bedroom up here. So we do have the first bedroom on the first floor. Four true bedrooms on this home. Living room, family room, dining room. Guys, this house has so much going for it for the money. Crown molding in here. Closet here. Now this will be the front of the house. And this will be the side of the house. And check this out, we have a second closet in this room. Wall mount for the TV stays in here as well. I love these floors, just a lot of character. Okay, next, I will meet you downstairs for a few closing statements. I'll meet you downstairs. So thanks for watching our video of 10th in Miamisburg, highly sought after area of Miamisburg. If you have any questions about this home or if you'd like to see it in person, feel free to give me a call. Again, my name is John Murray with the John Murray Group of Better Homes and Gardens Real Estate. I can be reached at area code 937-654-7355 or by email, that is john, J-O-N, at buywithjohn.com. That's B-U-Y-W-I-T-H-J-O-N.com. Guys, this home is amazing. Let's just look at the update list here. Most of the door, a lot of the doors have been updated. Oversized baseboards, crown molding in just about every room, oversized two car garage, updated dimensional shingle roof, nice size back deck, four bedrooms, two full baths, a partially, or it's a finished, semi, part of the basement is finished. There is stuff for storage with a finished area. Updated high efficiency furnace, air conditioner, water heater, the kitchen was gutted and redone. This is all new with real wood countertops. All of the appliances stay. Glass backsplash, huge dining room, huge family room, huge living room. Guys, there's nothing to do to this house except move your stuff in and maybe paint your kid's room or your, other, your own room. This is a gorgeous, gorgeous house for the money, guys. Absolutely love it. I could keep going on, but come give me a call and come see it in person. Thanks for watching.